Milo Lekas centering the ball towards half forward. Up they go. It's going to hit the deck. McCabe waits back. In they go after it. Holland's got it. Tries to get in a hand pass. Tackled by McCabe was strong. They're charging in the Hawks. And the umpire will come in and bounce it just inside 50 for the Hawthorne club. It's just amazing when you apply yourself in a physical way and also a mental way to just get yourself up into a contest. The impossible can occur. A lot of people, a lot of football purists seem to think that Richmond would win quite convincingly, but at this stage, you'd certainly like to be involved with the Hawthorne team. They didn't tell the Hawthorne, obviously. McCabe, Richmond with numbers, Broderick. Well, there's the man of the match so far. Paul Salmon couldn't take the mark. Moore, first disposal. Gale, not a great disposal. Good block by Crawford, Shane Crawford, that is. Sees it over the boundary line, and the Hawk fans in front of us are pleased with that effort to throw in to take place on set to win. It just typifies when you do fumble, it's amazing how the pressure doubles. Just weighted numbers again, terrific stuff by Crawford, putting Gale. that physical pressure and also Crowe. Sorry, Mick, Gale trying to get front position over Salmon there. It shuffled out the back to Prescott, ridden into the ground by Crowe. The ball jarred free in the tackle, comes to Barker. Long kick to half forward, Turner. Harrison, now Crummel, had it and lost it, might get a second go, gets it to Lord, needs to be quick with the kick, puts it up for the breeze to take, won't quite take it far enough, Holland caught behind, ball past uh, Bowden it was, Crawford, up past his free kick, Hawthorne. Yes, the free kick was certainly there, it was helped probably by the position in the umpire, is directly behind the tackler in Callaway, as we see here, the ground level ball was picked up by Dixon, Raven straight in the back. Ben Dixon kicked a goal in the first quarter. Probably could have had two, but the second effort came and uh, he got a goal from close in. If this one had hurt, wouldn't it? It would. Oh. After Crawford's already kicked one in this quarter. Not an easy shot under windy conditions. Kick from 45. He likes it, and the crowd likes it. It's a goal. He's second. Yeah, certainly a terrific start. It was interesting to see the last time these two teams met it was Hawthorne who jumped into the game and caught a time with seven goals to one. And Richmond finally clawed their way back after uh, being led by 21 points at three-quarter time. They got over the line by just on a kick. But this situation, they'd want to turn it around fairly quickly, otherwise the game would be well and truly gone. Back to the centre. Salmon having a sensational game. The best man on the ground at the moment. McCabe couldn't grab it. It's given out by Campbell to Knights, but look at the pressure put on. Woods has it taken away by Broderick, but he's gang tackled by a couple of them. Look at the tackle on Campbell too. To Gale, who kicks to centre wing. It's thumped away. That's good play. Woods gets in a hand pass. Knights working hard. No, it's not. It's Black. Gives it across to Chaffee. They need a couple of quick goals. It's at half forward. Richard Taylor takes it away and drives it long to centre wing. Clap underneath it takes a safe mark. He gives it off to Campbell. Here they go through Harrison. The Tigers a chance here as he transfers play out to Richardson. He's dropped it. He's got pace. He's caught there by Trelevin. And the uprise played holding the ball as he attempted to kick. I think he missed it, Richardson. It's not their day, I don't think, Mick, the way they're going. Salmon. He's been having a... Well, it seems to have the ball on the string. Over the head of Evans, standing on the mark. Salmon's kick intended for Crummel. Gasper going with him. Gasper will be content to see this out, but he couldn't quite get it over the line. Rogers does just that. Very deft footwork. And it will be thrown in between wing and half forward left for Hawthorne. 18 to 9, the tackles. I was just going to say, Pete, there's no doubt Hawthorne have gone in with a the theme today, Operation Tackle, because they are ruthless in their approach to dispossess the Richmond team when they gain possession. Kick comes from Broderick. Down towards Powell, who marks on centre wing. Prescott, that right half forward, should and does give it to Campbell. Richardson looking for front position. Couldn't get there. Crow, it's quick, beats a few of them. Crowd's kick out towards the other side of the ground. Now Shane Crawford, just inside the boundary line, keeps it in play. 
Goes in short up towards centre wing. Not a great kick for Barker, but he will get there first. He does. Good bit of pace to get clear. Just from Gale. Evans in the road. The Birdman. The Pigeon Fancier. Played in two premiership sides with Springvale. Callaway from Broderick. That is uh, well, not much to gain from that. Moore gives it back to the boundary umpire. Throw it on centre wing. The Hawks by 33 points. Yes, and even their uh, normally good disposal has been a bit ordinary today. Richmond. Salmon. Did well. Oh, loose ball again. Shane Crawford is going to centre it towards half forward. Crummel up in front. It's no mark. It hits the deck. Rogers is caught. Good tackle there by Harford. And the umpire will bounce just outside 50. Just nothing happening for Richmond.